Hey everybody, DamiG17 here again, bringing you episode 3 of Let's Play Pokemon Alpha Sapphire. So, what I meant to do was make a episode 3 yesterday, but some things kind of got in the way, so I was pretty busy. But here I am right now, bringing you episode 3 of this Let's Play Alpha Sapphire. And, uh, yeah, so without further ado, let's get started on Alpha Sapphire again. So... What happened was last time we um, we uh, got to Petalburg Woods, defeated our, uh, well, first up to say, we ran into the first team, Aqua Grunt, since this is Alpha Sapphire, uh, in Petalburg City, uh, not Petalburg City, Petalburg Woods, and then we ended up kind of almost getting through. Last video I also mentioned that I uh, traded in a Ralts that I bred personally, and also traded in a... Halo, I think it was. So I managed to get those, and uh, Ralts ended up being shiny when I bred it. I just traded it in about two hours ago. So here's the team so far. We've got the Mudkip, the Poochiana, the Talo, and the Ralts. So without further ado, let's go take a look at this team. So here we have Mudkip, our starter. All right, Poochiana. Ralts and Artelo. So I ended up trading two uh two of those into no I'm sorry three of those into uh into Alpha Sapphire and one I guess just by random chance I managed to uh is the camera straight there we go okay uh the uh. I think it was the Ralts, no, the the Taylor. I'm sorry, the Taylor that it was. Uh, I was wonder trading Taylor on my other game, and I was wonder trading some Pokemon I got on uh, this game as well. And by extreme luck and random chance, I ended up getting myself over wonder trade. So we've got our own Taylor as well. All right, so let's continue out of this forest finally. And here we have. Uh, Spoiler alert for, well, nah, I guess I won't really say anything for any of those who haven't played the games yet, but for those of you who do know, you guys should be familiar with this. Oops, sorry about that. Alright, so here we are on route... Uh, route something. Route 4... Uh, not 404. 104. And I think we're gonna take a visit. And, okay, we'll leave those berries for later on. Because I know there's gonna be some good purposes for those berries. Such as contests. Um... <clears throat> oops. Almost knocked the camera off again. Alright, so here we have our little flower garden shop, and just to start off with. Alright, so flowers bloom, blah blah blah. Okay, so we get the Wilmer Pale, obvious right there. I uh, believe that's, if I'm not mistaken, that's the first key item we get in the game. Let's uh, take a look. So. Like in this game, uh, when a berry falls off, they'll grow right back. And let's go take a look at our bag and key items. Uh, no, I'm sorry, EXP share was the first key item. Wilmer Pale is the second item, so <laughs> one item off. But oh well. It's not like the point of this Let's Play is to count the order of key items that we get. Alright, so... What we'll do now is leave Mudkip in the beginning of the team since it's one level lower than everyone else and I guess we're going to end up battling some trainers since we're kind of forced to here and there so let's do this.
All right, there you have it. There are some battles that we just had to get through. Um, now we should really get on our way to Rustboro City. Uh, let's talk to this old lady. See what she has to say. All right, so she'll give us a chest of berries. So that's pretty good. Um, uh, maybe one moment here. Sorry about this. All right, there we go. That's better. Um. So yeah, berries go up here. Dang it. No, not the person that I wanted to battle. I just wanted to talk to him. I didn't know he was going to battle me. Alright, I guess we'll go through this battle as well. So, oh, there's a match card, but I think we can just get through this easy. But as I've noticed, uh, <laughs> one of our teammates kind of ignored us in the last battle. So, hopefully this goes by easy, quick, without any trouble. Alright, so... Luciana gains some EXP. Magikarp again? Dang. I don't know where you're aiming to go with those Magikarp. But wherever it is, it's... Down to a loss. Splash, nothing's gonna happen of course. Poochiana ignored me. And now it's gonna use Bite, like a 1 or 2. And Magikarp is down. Well, the first one was down already as well. <laughs> um, I think the last one's gonna be a Magikarp. Oh, who would have figured? Who would have figured? Oh, baby, a triple! All right, here we go. Last Magikarp, and it's gonna use Flash, and nothing happened, of course, just like with this Poochiana. And uh, why? I know I don't have enough badges, but this low of a level, seriously? Uh, one of these days, you're gonna get splashed to death, and I'm going to laugh. I'm gonna laugh so hard. And... I don't know. I'm gonna do something. And... That something that's something going to be a, just a camera first. Alright, alright. Maybe this will work. Sorry about this, guys. I really gotta adjust that. Gotta memorize good positions so this uh, video ends up being good for you guys to watch. Um, come on, Poochiana, really? <laughs> You're gonna get splashed all over the place. Not that, you know. Uh, Alright, finally, bite on the Magikarp. What a pain. Alright, maybe that'll work. I don't know. Oh, well, either way, this is as good as I can get it. And as long as you guys can see the whole screen, then it's all good. It's all good. Um, alright, so we're gonna just, is that a puddle? Oh, that's a puddle. Okay, so we're gonna go to the Pokemon Center once we're not interrupted by someone in the game. Alright, yeah, that's our rival May. Eh, it's not that big, I've seen bigger. Um, alright, alright, alright. So, see you later, yep, yep. Ciao. And, okay, now we're gonna go visit a Pokemon Center. Without interruptions. And we're gonna let our teammates heal, and... Yeah. Sorry about that. Alright. Arrow, for those of you who uh, watched uh, episode 2 of Let's Play Alpha Sapphire, I mentioned that it was raining a crap load over here, and I, I, I'm the, one of those people that loves the rain. 
I thought it would be just kind of ironic if by the time I got to Kyogre in this game, that it would also be raining in uh, actual life once I'm at the point to catching Kyogre. I mean, that, that'd, be, that'd be awesome. And for those of you uh, Omega Ruby players, uh, just having the sunshine with hot weather all day while you're catching Groudon. <laughs> Alright, so here we have Roxanne, the gym leader, and yeah, obviously we're a new challenger. Um, she's a gym leader of Rustboro City, and a gym leader so that I may apply and battle all that I've learned in the Pokemon Trainer School. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, if I defeat her, I'll get a badge and something else, blah, blah, blah. We all know that. Well, I hope we all know that. Um, what we're gonna do is switch up with the Ralts first, and then put Mudkip in the second slot. Um, we're gonna save Mudkip so we don't have to, uh, we're gonna try not to go back to the Pokemon Center so often. So, we'll send out Ralts first with that modest nature and just use some stab moves. And here we have Youngster Jaw sending out Geodude. So that shouldn't be too difficult. Ralts is going to go out and we're probably going to end up using Confusion just to start off with. I mean either- oh, it's dirty, dang it. Well, it's a good thing I have that to let me know what ability it's got. But, um, what I was going to say is, uh... Confusion should do for now. Disarming voice. I've also got that. Um, whatever it is, uh, it'll have stab. So, and for those of you who don't know what uh, stab means, stab uh, stands for same type attack bonus. So, Ralt is a fairy psychic type, and if I use Confusion, which is a psychic type, Confusion will gain an added uh, attack bonus. Um. Also, like with, uh, you know, like flying types like Pidgey and Peck, uh, Peck will gain an extra attack bonus. So, and anything that's the same type as the attacker, it will get an added bonus. And this is only for, uh, attack moves, not, uh, status or, uh, Stat or status moves, such as like Toxic or Defense Curl, like this Geodude just used. Um, all right, so we can kind of notice that the Ralts is starting to ignore us a little bit. Uh, here we have Taylor learning Wing Attack, so that's pretty good. Uh, I think we'll delete Focus Energy. I've never really had a use for Focus Energy before, so goodbye with that. All right, so you're gonna learn Wing Attack. And you're gonna send out another Geodude, which is hopefully not with sturdy ability. Uh, Ralts, that'd be very nice if you wouldn't ignore us. And you're loafing around, that's great. That's great. No, it's not. It's not great. And you turned away, that's, uh, that's really fancy of you, you know? Alright. You're not a bang. You're you suck right now. I was hoping not to have to go to the Pokemon Center so often in the beginning of the game, but I guess that's gonna change. Jiru is gonna use tackle, and that's gonna take out the Ralts. Three hit KO, I believe. Three hit or four hit KO. Uh, we're gonna send her to Poochiana. and. <clears throat> Sorry. And we're gonna attempt to use Bite. Really? Come on. I don't know why Nintendo put this in here in the first place. Oh, Nintendo Game Freak. One works for the other. Alright, so Geodude goes down. And that should be the end of that battle. Uh, and then we're gonna go on to the next trainer. Alrighty, so we're gonna go to team switch uh, Waltz and Pucciana. So here we go. On to the next trainer. 
You can't beat me, blah blah blah. I've beaten you like hundred times over. Back in Ruby, Sapphire, Emerald, Alpha Sapphire, Omega Ruby. Yeah. Geodude again, as we can see, <laughs> this is a rock type gym, obvious with the fossils in the background. And also the stone walls, the round walls, whatever you want to call them. Alright, so we're going to use another bite attack. Hopefully Poochian will do something, and it does. And then we're going to attempt another bite. Hopefully this will one shot this time, one shot. And of course, of course. Alright, so they say third time's a charm, so let's bite again. And you're loafing around. Really? You're a big jerk, you know that? And you turned away. Well, that's, that's nice. That's really nice. And pretend not to notice. Oh my god. Well, this isn't getting us anywhere, so we're gonna have to send out the mud kit. Normally this ends up pretty fairly well, but I guess just not this time. Uh, okay, we're gonna go ahead and use the water gun for the heck of it, because all the ignorance of all these tiny little Pokemon are just Annoying. Alright, so Geodude gets taken out by Mudkip. At least somebody likes to listen, you know. Alright, so that leaves two trainers down, one more to go. And then once that third trainer is down, we will battle the gym leader finally. Which I plan to do in episode two, but just didn't have enough time to get to it, you know? Alright, so... Blah blah blah. Alrighty. Yeah, number two trainers go not for long. Not after I beat you. Alright, so got another Geodude. Nothing new here. Kinda reminds me of the gym back in Fire and Leaf Green. They all had Geodude, Diglett, Sandshrew. You can you name it, you know. Did Mudkip just ignore me? Don't, don't start this. Aww. Don't do this, Mudkip. Okay, so Mudkip ended up using Mudshot, I think it was. Mud Slap or Mud Shot, whatever move that was. Too many mud moves. Okay, Mud Slap. Please use Water Gun. Thank you. I can't have a Water Type losing to a Rock Type. That would just really not go well. Alright, so, looks like we will have to go back to the Pokemon Center. Um, Geodudes have invaded my team and have taken out Ralts and Poochiana and yeah, we're gonna go back to the to the Poke Center. Alright. Okay, we're gonna just chillax for a bit. Brim, 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 brim. Alright, here we go. And now we're gonna go back to the gym. And finally, just finally battle the gym leader. The dream, the hope, the badge, the mud kit. Oh, look, I can just walk around. Okay, so we're gonna save here just in case. We're gonna send out the Poochiana first. 
since she will be sending out a Geodude first. <coughs> Excuse me there. See, that's a nice fossil background. Um, I want to save Mudkip for her last Pokemon, which will be Nosepass, because Nosepass will get defensive as heck, and I really hate that. So here we go. Roxanne.
<laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, and there you have it. Uh, there's our first gym badge. And also, we get TM39, Rock Tomb. Oh, man. To be honest, I thought that uh, Mudkip would end up uh, getting taken out before we could even deliver the final blow of Mud Slap onto Nose Pass, but we we did it. We got a first badge. <clears throat> Nose Pass using Harden, thinking that I was going to use physical moves. <laughs> Because that battle was extremely hard. Anyways, let's get out of this gym and into the Pokemon Center again. I almost felt like a sun made the sound. Blah, 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 blah. Uh, anyway, that's not the point. Anyways, uh, Team Magma. No, Team Aqua Grunt. I'm sorry. Alright, so we're gonna heal these characters real quick, and I'm afraid it's time to say goodbye for this episode. Uh, stick around for more. Ep episode 4 of Let's Play Pokemon Alpha Sapphire will be coming soon. Uh, as I said in previous videos, I will be busy with other things as well, so I will try to do this as often as possible and, uh, you know, just with as much time as I've got. Um, other than that, hopefully you enjoy, uh, click, uh, you know, click, subscribe, like, uh, leave a comment, and see ya.